What we're building here is two new state-of-the-art supercritical coal-fired um, generating units. It's an expansion to an existing power plant that we've had operating here since the 1950s. Uh, these two new units will burn um, high-energy bituminous coal from the Appalachian Mountains and will supply electricity into the national grid to um, uh, Wisconsin Energy's consumers. Ready whenever you are. The project has uh, been in construction since uh, June 2005 and uh, Unit 1 is a little over 98% finished. Unit 2 is around 80% finished um, and uh, Unit 2 will be completed um, around uh, end of August is the target, end of August next year. Coal is delivered by train to the site. Uh, coal is supplied via conveyors into the uh, coal silo and uh, the coal is then fed into a pulverizer which grinds the coal into a, like a talcum powder where it's then mixed with, uh, with air and blown into a boiler cavity. Uh, at that point it's ignited, uh, the, the uh, powdered coal ignites in the boiler, creates a furnace and the heat from the furnace is passed into the water which, is, it, it, which makes up the, uh, the walls of the boiler cavity. Uh, that water is then turned into steam. Steam is then supplied to the turbine which turns uh, at uh, 3,600 revolutions per minute and generates electricity through a generator. So the steam turbine is connected to a generator which then generates power which is fed back into the grid.